Thanks for staying tuned to STL Live. I'm Sarah Thompson, and I'm joined by Matthew Viverito from the Free Flying Trapeze Show. You are also a trapeze artist. This is crazy, yes? Yeah, it's, it's <laughs> a lot of fun. Uh, I run the Circus Harmony Flying Trapeze Center down at Union Station, and we're doing a free flying trapeze show this Saturday at 4 o'clock. Okay, so we'll, we'll first talk about the show, and then I'm going to have to ask you how you got to be, how you became a trapeze artist, sure. not just a manager at Circus Harmony, but how you got into trapeze and sure. circus arts. But first, let's focus on the free performance. Tell me a bit more about it. Uh, so we're doing a show this Saturday at 4 o'clock. It uh, features a variety of different circus acts, and then it will feature the flying trapeze as the finale act. Uh, after the show, we'll do a quick promotion where if you yourself want to try the flying trapeze, if you're feeling inspired by what you saw, you can give it your, uh, you can give it a try yourself for a small fee. Okay, so we're taking a look. I think at that photo, that was a group of you. Is that are those the performers? Still uh, performing? That, that's one of our students. That's her first time flying on the trapeze, actually. So oh, you, really? You can tell it's a lot of fun. Yeah. Okay, and actually, if we can go back to that photo before, are those the performers? Tell me about what the show. There it looks like six perform. Is that six of you? Yeah. Um, or five of you. Um, or six of you. <laughs> um, tell me about the show. What does it consist of? Like, how do you put together? How long is it? Is it an hour-long show? Uh, it's, it's a pretty short show. It's oh, okay. only 30 minutes. 30 minutes. It is outside, so it'll probably be pretty warm. We don't sure. want to make people sit out in the, in the <laughs> hot for, for too long. Um, but yeah, it's a short show. It'll feature a couple of different aerial acts. We've got a double trapeze routine, of course, the flying trapeze, and then it'll feature some of our students at Circus Harmony doing okay. some uh, circus acts on the ground. Okay, mm -hmm. all right, I'll take a look. So I remember last year you did this, you had funding essentially to mm -hmm. do a free flying trapeze every weekend, was it? Once every week? Yeah, it was uh, every Friday. Uh, it was underwritten by PNC um, as a way to make the flying trapeze available to people who might not be able to afford it otherwise. So the spirit of the show, it, it's, it's kind of along those same lines with the promotion after the show is we want to give people the opportunity to try the flying trapeze uh, at, a, at a reduced cost to really make it accessible for whoever wants to do it. So what's it like being, how high up are you when you're on a trapeze? The platform is about 22, 23 feet off the ground, but it's important to remember you're never too far from the safety net. Safety net below you at all times. <laughs> yes. Thank you. That's yes. a good, a good remark. Sure. Well, how high is the safety net off the ground? Uh, safety net's about eight or nine feet off the ground. Okay. So uh, not too far of a drop. Plus, you're in the safety lines the whole time. So how do people, when they get the chance, which they will if they'd like to, Correct. you know, for the added fee to do that after the show, mm -hmm. how do people like being up on the trapeze? Is it, is it difficult arm strength or is it just um, so much fun? Surprisingly, or? doesn't matter how strong you are. Doesn't matter how flexible you are. Really, all you have to do is follow the instructions you're given, and pretty much anyone can do the flying trapeze. How did you get into, so back to you, how did you get into trapeze artistry and arts, if that's, if right. that's, if sure. if that's yeah, the way that to works. title it? Um, so I was a member of the St. Louis Arches uh, growing up, which is the advanced troupe at Circus Harmony. Um, we did performances all around the St. Louis area um, and all around the country. Um, we do all kinds of circus acts and um, I had such a great time doing that when it was time for me to go to college. I wasn't quite ready to give up the circus. Uh, so I went to Florida State University where they have a fully functioning circus program and then that's where I learned flying trapeze. Wow, and so how do you, what, what's the difference in terms of what you're doing in college when you're studying this? I mean, versus, like where does it go in terms of your curriculum in your classes? So you could think of the program there as kind of like a club sport. So okay. I do have a degree in uh, psychology. I have uh -huh. a bachelor's in that. Um, and then all of my free time pretty much was spent doing what I love, which was learning the circus and specifically the flying trapeze. And then after that, I performed professionally for about 18 months doing the flying trapeze. And I was thrilled when I heard that Circus Harmony would be bringing flying trapeze to St. Louis, and I just had to be a part of it. And so when you don't catch someone and they fall, okay. is it, I mean, for you, it's probably not scary, but I mean, is it that first time you fall, I mean, is that a scary feeling or does it feel pretty, actually cool because you're bouncing right. on so this it, it, trampoline, essentially? It varies from person to person. Uh, the first time you try it, it's definitely a rush. Um, we give people all the tools they need to succeed. So whether they get caught, don't get caught, do the trick, don't do the trick. Um, you know, we really put people in the best position to come out and have a good time on the trapeze. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah. It sounds like so much fun. Well, if you would like to try 
your to have your chance to be on the trapeze. You can check it out this weekend. It's really a show. It's a free flying trapeze show. They do the show for about 30 minutes, and then afterwards, it's totally free to the public. And afterwards, for a small fee, you can try your chance on the trapeze and get a right. chance to do some cool stuff. It's this Saturday, July 25th at 4 p.m. down at Union Station. That's 1820 Market Street. But again, at Union Station, for more information, go to trapezestl.com. But we're not done yet. We're actually going to talk more about Circus Harmony and all the cool stuff they do. So stay with us. We'll be right back after this break.